What's up, y'all? We in this thing. Yeah, I ain't in this thing. Yeah, I ain't in this thing. Look at my nails. They're freaking hideous. Well, we cut the phoenix. Yeah, I ain't in this thing. Yeah, I ain't in this thing. Let me see you make that pussy pop. <laughs> How y'all doing? I'm still doing $15 readings. It's Empress Watson. Like, share, subscribe, and let's go. So, today I was so anxious to go outside that I didn't even want to go. <laughs> it was, it's the weirdest feeling in the world. And then we out here beautifying ourselves, me and my daughter. To be continued. We ain't finished. Ooh, bonfire. Ooh. So, I hope everybody is well. I hope everybody is grateful. I hope everyone is appreciative. Learn to be grateful. Learn to be appreciative. Stop. No victim behavior. Oh, why me? No pouting and whining. No. No. I just got such a good energy right now, y'all. That's it. What's energy for cancer, yo, cups? Okay, because it's witching season. Stink. Witching season. What's the energy for cancer, yo, cups? Good and ancestors. Earth. Earth worship. Until my body is in your arms, I will worship you, dear mother of mine. That was so sad. I don't even know how to take that. Number seven. That's our number. Go shake that left it, tubby. Left it, tubby. Okay, until my body is in your arms, I will worship you, dear mother of mine. Damn, earth worship is a card of celebration for the fulfillment of a journey. That's why I feel like this, because baby, I can flip, I can do car wheels, I can run around, jump around on the couch and stuff. I got this energy out of nowhere, and it's like the, the journey, it feel like we are accepting the path. We are accepting the heartache, accepting and understanding why we had to go through what we had to go through. We have we have formed the acceptance of it because we know where it ends. Yes, you have achieved much and have much to celebrate. We did, y'all. We did. It's a new dawn. It's a new day, and I feel good. I know. But I do, I feel good. But I keep making food that I don't eat. And then I keep trying to put it off on my son, but he on some, uh, nah, I'm good. Like, it's like everybody in the house ain't eating. Like the season flowing from one to another, you too have reached a place of harmony and wholeness. Even if your dreams are not yet fulfilled, your spirit is at peace and knows all is well. It is, though. I, mean, I don't even care if you're behind in your rank. Like, you already know it's no need to super extra stress over shit no more. Because it's meant to be played out a certain way to reach a certain outcome. Take some time to reflect on your journey. What lessons have you learned? Remember I told you it's not about their karma. It's about the lesson you learn. Because people blind themselves from uh, obsessing over someone getting karma because of their heartache and their pain. They don't realize sometimes their karma or their heartache and pain is inflicted because of some karma that they were due. In what ways can you express gratitude for all that you have done? Didn't I just say I was grateful? I was grateful for y'all. I'm grateful for sunshine. Grateful for rain. I love that song. I am I'm really grateful for y'all. Appreciative for y'all. The people who inbox me. The people who think I'm supposed to be their personal assistants. And just run and do readings for shit. When never. And it, 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 this, this is the thing. In order for something to survive, you have to feed into it. So you can't keep... It's like we talk about um, in the readings. It's equal reciprocity. You want something from me, you have to feed something into it. And I can see my subscribers and my likes. But the funny thing is, there's a lot of people who don't subscribe and don't like. Who's 
asking and requesting things. And that's so crazy. So what gratitude is that? It's, it's, it's the audacity to me. That's how I feel. The audacity. So I'm not overly giving to nothing no more. From this to the kids. I'm not overly about to be that mom that's overbearing anymore i just let me know when you need me so i have more time for myself that's why i got this i have this energy now because i'm not about to keep on trying to please it's all the way from somebody complaining about uh me laughing too much my music can i do this sign can i do that sign can i do this and you never even went to my other page and follow my other page it's like come on now be fucking for real but it's still down in the description box where you can tip and donate and help the dog on channel. And if you got nothing, I understand that. But why is it so hard to like and subscribe? I don't get it. I'm not about to get it. Let the to to totality of your life step into your bones and protect all that you have just as you protect our beauty, Earth Mother. The energy that goes into readings and then only get no some people don't even give a thank you. It's, it's like a really like I'm supposed to do this. So for everybody that thanks me, for everybody that like and subscribe, I am appreciative of you. Because I want to get to at least my thousand subscribers by this, the end of the year. Oh, I am going to go rogue. I am out of here. I am. I'm going to find another platform, a more appreciative platform. Because I understand it's a battle out here with a lot of readers. It is, I understand. But it's only free to like and subscribe. The most literal expression of this card is to seek ways to do your part to heal the planet. Consider adopting a zero-waste lifestyle, eating organic foods, or volunteering in earth-based charities. As you work to heal Mother Earth, so shall she support you on your path to the future success. That's some real shit because I ended a whole day. Because you want to know what the dude did? He littered. And then he wouldn't stop. Then he had told me, well, I can get the fuck on. Guess what? I'm about to get the fuck on. So then I don't think he expected me to really get the fuck on. Don't ask me, am I getting in the car? No, I don't want nothing to do with your kind. And he's like, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm going to go pick it up. Yeah, go on, pick it up. Drop me off, bitch, because I'm good. Like, what's the point in that, though? I don't understand that. You just sit out here and just take everything in your car and splat right on the damn ground. I can't stand it, man. I can't stand it. Tell me about this earth worship energy for Cancer Leo Cups. You about to start seeing Mother Nature out here protecting you. Pay attention to your flowers blooming. You probably trying to figure out why the animals surrounding you attacking you, especially them bees. These bees, this blue, blue bee looking thing that moved in my stairs when I first moved here. And I just never bothered him and his family or closed them up. But something had happened. Something had happened and they all had came out on the attack though. And I just remember uh, running them off. I ran the thing. What was it though? It was something in my yard. And the bee, the bee things didn't like it. Thank you for sunshine. Thank you for rain. I thank you for being here. I thank you for my children. I thank you for my family. I thank you for my cats. My ancestor cats. Four cups. I feel like with this four of cups, somebody is thinking about the things that were said, the things that was done, the things that grew, and the things that got pouring out, the things that, this is a lot going on. Hold on, there's a lot going on in this car. <laughs> Bro, what the fuck? You see that stick man back there? 
It looks like somebody thinking about all the um, the journey in their life, how they didn't miss something. Something is a missed opportunity. Somebody could be accepting the challenge of a missed opportunity. I don't know. Let's get into it. What's this worship energy for Cancer Leo? Because I feel like a lot of y'all about to move or something. And by the time somebody get back to you, you ain't there no more. More about Cancer Leo plus spirit and ancestors in the seven. The seventh oracle. Oh, remember never in this story in the seventh oracle. Oh, I gotta look it up. Oh, look, Ten of Pentacles tried to flip over. Look, Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, you done moved. Tell me about Cancer Leo plus spirit and ancestors. 32, feeling God is a protector. Two of Wands. Yep, you headed on out. Temperance, patience, and healing. Two of Wands, you figuring out which way you're going to go, but you headed. You're trying to decipher your direction. Choose which way you're going. East, west, north, south. You're trying to leave the country, stay in the country. What you trying to do? <laughs> Tell me more, Spirit and Ancestors, for Cancer Leo Cup. Word up. Hey. Word up. Hey, man, I juiced a pineapple and a red pepper. I sure did. And then the, the Starbucks by my house, they had made these little sap, sample drinks. Ace of Pentacles is in reverse. They made these sample drinks. And it was good as hell. So I went back and asked them, can I have one in real life? Because that little bitty cup, it stressed me out. Why the Ace of Pentacles in reverse? Why is the Ace of Pentacles in reverse to cancel the old cups? Ah. Now the cups is in reverse. Scorpio energy here. Feel like somebody missed out on an opportunity with you. You that 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 is what this feeling is. Somebody missed out on an opportunity because they was being too selfish and being too greedy. Could be somebody who's sitting up here seeking out people who can financially help them or somebody they can financially grant drain. Somebody could be trying to see what what your pockets looking like, what you got going on, what's your material wealth out here. This could be somebody seeking material wealth. Why they in the nine of cups in reverse energy? Are you feeling this? Temperance, patience, and healing. You could have rejected the offer, denied the offer, delay in the offer, but you find some type of patience, a balance in this situation. Because somebody is unfulfilled. It, it, it feels like somebody feeling like, how, do you, how are you fulfilled by having nothing? But you don't have enough. I, I don't know. Sagittarius. What is this temperance energy about? The princess of Pentacles. Oh, baby. This is the damn empress in the making. This is a cold ass. So you rejected somebody's offer because you already knew what you're. See, look, princess in the making. Look at her. The beginning stages of her fucking pregnancy. She about to give birth to this motherfucker. That's what's happening. You rejected somebody. Somebody's been rejected. It, you rejected them because they tried to come at you like with a financial offer or try to rub some type of finances in your face. This is like a situation where is it that somebody tried to make it seem like you needed them, but really they needed you. With you know fixing their inner issues with a bad bitch, but how the song originally go? I was good on my own. That's the way it was. You was good on the low for a faded fuck, yeah. Shit, what the fuck you complaining up? Yeah, that's exactly what it was. You good on your dog on own. They came in trying to mess with you. They needed you. You needed me. Yeah, they wasn't real. They wasn't real. You've been doing a lot of studying. See, this is the part people don't understand about you is your patience. That's why you feeling so good. You was doing the work of the ancestors, the work of spirit, feeding and nourishing the, the, the animals, the trees, whatever you was doing. 
you was doing spiritual work and they didn't understand it because they was out here doing 3D work. You know what I'm saying? Scamming and shit. I keep saying scamming. Yeah, they working they back to the doggone bone. They like, but you quit your job. Because I can't work for nobody right now when I, I, I got spirit. I didn't see spirit come through for me, so why would I go work for somebody? I'm just going to keep doing, mastering my craft. Something you about to take on, this project you about to take on is preparing you to be an a empress. Or if not, you didn't move to empress level. I don't even know it. You rejected somebody's offer for your peace. They came in with some bullshit, honestly. Some selfish ass bullshit. They like, what? Well, if somebody wants you to kiss their ass or something. Somebody, well, you just happy in the midst of confusion. Tell me about the Princess of Pentacles. Word up. Hey. Word up. Hey. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. Spirit, you ain't got to talk, Craig. You ain't got to talk. Tell me about this Princess of Pentacles. What's going on? Four wands. Wow. I don't feel like this is one with somebody else. A lot of people try to make connecting with a feminine or connecting with a masculine is a thing or a, a, a humanoid. No, it's with you. Connecting with the balance within you. You got to, the feminine need to balance out her masculine energy with her feminine energy and the masculine need to balance out his feminine energy with his masculine energy. This is a, a, a balance. People searching the world looking for a ma masculine to balance them. No, you got to balance the one inside of you. Okay? No, know, know how to put your armor down. Know how to put it up. You know. We put that armor up for them damn kids for some reason. Whoo child. Why the spirit even do it like this? Spirit just have us out here tripping on when it comes to these damn kids. That's why my sister said she wasn't having kids. She don't want that bond. Because she'll kill somebody. And I'm like, yep. Yeah. Honestly, you about to prepare yourself for a celebration. Of a lifetime. You about to win something. You about to get something. Something about to go your way. Stink. It, it, thy will be done. That's what happened. On earth as it is in what year. Feel like y'all about to align you could be about to align with somebody in the business world and they might bring forth a lot of revenue for you this look like a lot of revenue something you asked for whatever you manifested during these portals being open some of y'all probably are seeing things and and like i said with me and I, sometimes i keep stuff to myself now nah, you're not about i'm not about to be uh burnt at the stake i ain't ready tell me What's the celebration about the four of wands? This is not just a reunion. This is just you celebrating high priestess. Oh, Lord, here we go with this shit. This could be you celebrating your level up. Because, you know, when you level up to a high, high, high priestess, you level the fuck up. That's a cold motherfucker. People going to start seeing you as somebody important. This is spirit. Also, it's saying none of your damn business. Wait till you get here. So we got to wait to spirit say we can see what it is. We don't know what it is. Because that, that's what I just heard spirit say, mind your business. Mind your business, lady. So we got to mind our business, y'all. I'm not I'm not going past that. Because that's what I heard. And that's what I'm going to do. Any more messages here for Cancer Leo Club Spirit and Ancestors? Yeah, ain't about to get me cussed out. I ain't about to have cheers falling over. The Four of Cups is in reverse now. Somebody is returning to a missed opportunity. Somebody's go, go get it, go get it, go get, go get your blessings. <laughs> Y'all tell I love that song. Yeah, somebody coming in. I'm going in. I'm going in. I'm going in. Yeah, somebody about to pull up with some blessings, y'all. Blessings. The protection of the blessings is the perfection of the next sign on.
Some of y'all could just be trapped. Or some of y'all could be moving, like, changing your life so you can get your blessings. You know what I'm saying? Because sometimes when you blocked or it's like a particular area of surrounding that you in that you, you know you're supposed to have more, receive more, be getting more, but you're not because you in an area or surrounding some people, something, or you're constantly keeping this toxicity stuck in your head and you got to get the hell on to receive your blessings. So a lot of y'all is making room to clear, clearing shit out to get your blessings. I can dig that on some real ass shit. That's some real ass shit. Tell me about, tell me more for Cancer Leo Cups. Anything else for Cancer Leo Cups? Some of y'all got to get out your head though. The tower is in reverse. Why is the tower? Honestly, this might be somebody else. This might be somebody else, maybe a Scorpio that's in their head about moving forward about change this is a fixed energy so somebody needs to move uh, aries too it's time to budge tell me about the tower why is the tower in reverse they're trying to avoid something trying to avoid disaster but you have sometimes take on the disaster let them wipe it all out what's that sound blown away Carrie Underwood, blow it all away. Some of y'all are like, I want to hold on to my dresser. I want to hold on to this house. I want to hold on. What did Melanie Ho say? God said go. Get the fuck on. Tell me about the... Okay, okay. Scar clown, look. Do... Let me tell you something, Bottom. A dog may not make this journey alone. Be the wolf. But need be, the wolf can. See, the scar clown don't give a fuck. He out here. He ain't scared of nothing. He out here about to start his journey. It's a new day. It's a new dawn. It's a new day. Wait, hold on. Hold on. I must have got him mixed up with the star man. Because that clown is crazy. Number zero. Oh, the star man is the man. Okay, okay, okay. Yes, it's the clown. I mean, it's the fool. Take that leap of faith. A lot of y'all are about to take a leap of faith. Y'all scared. Y'all think it's going to go wrong. Take the leap of faith. Spirit said do it. Damn it, spirit waiting on you. And you supposed to be waiting on spirit. And you got spirit waiting on you. Aries energy. Why is this fool here? What's this leap of faith about? Prince of Pentacles. Baby, the money going to come when you jump. This is loyal. Spirit's about to show you they loyal to your ass. Don't fucking worry. Just get your ass out here and go and make it happen. You got the Princess of Pentacles and the Prince of Freaking Pentacles. This is the man before the emperor. This is the woman before the empress. This is the teenage energy or the young, you, the youthful energy before you become the Don Diddy. Da, 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 da. This can be you. You probably took the leap of faith. Don't know where the fuck you're going, though. Spirit just said prepare to celebrate. And this could be somebody else scared as fuck and on their way to take a leap of faith. Or well, maybe it's somebody coming towards your ass. What y'all think? Is this somebody coming to you? Because this is feeling totally different, my blood. Just, just, just this time, ask the fool, set your plan up, have it all lined up. We're going to do this, we're going to do that, so we're going to apply for this house, that house, and this house, right? Whoever approve us, we're going to go for it, because make sure it's three houses that you want, make sure it's three cars that you want, or make sure it's three states that you like. So once you pick that, you can start the process of uh, getting rid of shit. Throw them away, throw that computer away, it been dead six years ago, like declutter. Okay, air that bitch out. And then move forward. Take out your path. Don't be scared of your path. Your journey you were meant to be on. What's, what else going on here, Spirit and Ancestors? So don't just be a star fool out here just traveling around and become a fool in reverse, scared of anything. You ain't scared of nothing now. Tell me more, Spirit and Ancestors, for cancer your face. 
the nine of swords. You're scared. It's, you're scared. It's agony surrounding this. It's a lot of fear surrounding this. So if you're scared, then what the hell are you looking at tarot for? If you're scared, what the hell are you wanting change, need change, but ain't getting no results? You stressed and worried. Some of y'all don't even know which way to go. Some of y'all are crying at night. Your stomach hurts, your head hurts, your back hurt, your neck hurt, your neck and your back hurt. <laughs> Either you gonna leap or you can leave me alone. Okay, leap. Homegirl up here rejecting all offers because she about to give birth to what spirit gave her. She's already the umbilical cord to the universe. She ain't worried about nothing, okay? But this fool is scared. It's like he's still walking, but he's scared. He's in his mind. He's <sighs> the, the, the misery within his head is what was that? I want to hear the music. I don't want to hear that. Understand or start figuring out what your trauma is, your turmoil, what's driving you crazy, what's making you go crazy, what's, what's feeding your head. Clarify the nine of swords. What's going on with this nine of swords energy? Why is this nine of swords energy here? The five of cups some regret this must be you it's some type of regret here this could be somebody regretting not moving forward with you somebody's out on their own trying to figure out which way to go what to do but they can't get this out their head something about this they can't get out their fucking head it's eating them up because baby it feel like i'm about to go bleh. What's eating this person up? What's going on in this, this fool's head? What is it they can't get off their head? I just can't get a friend request. So somebody could be trying to come towards you and it's like they, they fingers shaking like to push the button. They scared to push the button, bro. I'm down. I'm so down. Why is this person scared of this friend request? They can't feel the okay. Why they ain't regretted this friend request? Maybe it's somebody else for some reason. I I have a feeling. Whoa. Why is they fearing this, this friend request, spirit and ancestors? Why is somebody fearing this friend request? Over here with the car, it's like a really great car. Friend request, very nice. That's a fair fight of friend request. Sissy cups, somebody in your past. I feel like this person fear this friend request because they want a, a a happy reply back from you. They want you to remember the good times. They want you to remember the good in them. They want you to they want you to forgive them. They want you to see them in a good light. But I don't think that's happening. I mean, you might have been a today one, but you moving on. I'll be moving on. Who's sending this friend request? Somebody wants you to send it. That's how I feel like. Somebody waiting on you to find them in the dugout to send a friend request. A devil, Capricorn. The moon is in reverse. this to be released the devil in reverse they want this to be released they want this to be over with they want the toxicity to be done this is somebody you finally released and done with what is this devil energy spirit and 
What is the devil that was going to release? Clarify the devil in reverse. Cancer, a mirror. Mirroring each other, self image relationship reflect our wounds and introspection. This person must bother you or trigger you. Soulmates, soul connection, partnerships, agreement, and the soul contract. Who is this person? How did my cancer Leo plus know who this person is? The snake. Competition, enemy, clever, malicious, look over your shoulder and the other woman. So, tricky ass bitch. Somebody left this hoe. That's what happened. This hoe got left. Somebody has released this devil. And if I could try to friend request you or get into some type of contact with you or since he, she, heard them been released, they feeling like somebody can't run it back to you is what they happened. But somebody is out here in despair because they feel like they fucked up the connection with you because they connected with a snake ass bitch. Tell us about this snake ass bitch spirit. Ten of Pentacles. Why is the snake ass bitch Ten of Pentacles? Judgment in reverse. That bitch ain't no ten of pentacles. That bitch wish she was a ten of pentacles. This bitch wish she was a ten of pentacles. She portrayed as if she was stable. She was wealthy. She had it made. She was the goose that laid the golden edge. This bitch probably actually actually tried to fuck up your funds, fuck up your stability, get you kicked out, get you fucked all up in the get all gone game so she could feel like the more superior being. She probably said you was the snake ass bitch. That's why this person in regret because they should have knew better. They got the four or five and six of cups, baby. You fucked up out here. Your intuition is fucked up. What energy is this snake ass bitch? What energy is this snake ass bitch spitting in fact? Because look at him beating that bitch ass dog. Y'all hear him? I gotta beat the dumb bitch. An Aries. Ooh, that Aries came out right here. Some of y'all could be dealing with an Aries. Wait, get your ass out of here. What energy is this snake ass bitch? This could be a friend or a family member or a lover. A lover of a lover. This is somebody that could just really, really have a a serious hate for you. Y'all keep thinking you told y'all friends. Keep on thinking that bitch your friend. Probably was that damn Aries. Fire. That's the fucking Aries. It, it, it was one of them bitches. Who gives a shit? The motherfucker out here. And they got a problem with you. And I always tell y'all, fire, I always get mad at water because we put the bitches out. Especially when they're talking stupid. A balance, real balancing in her power, fire sign can be your best fucking friend. They'll ride her. That imbalance, bitch, fuck that hoe. Jealous that look, she got justice in reverse and judgment. So whatever scheme she pulled off to keep this masculine energy or feminine energy, whatever y'all got going on, has backfired on that hoe. And it has come to pass. That bitch is both good. And it's probably got them twisted up in this shit, too. That's why they so fucking fucked up in their head. Like, all of the shit I was doing with you, all the stuff they was doing with you, they was living their best life. But, baby, it's cap nine. You know what? This bitch was uh, uh, very judgmental because this, I'm feeling like y'all probably had a one minute woman. This energy have talked to you, communicated with you some type of way, even if it through, was through something fake. Y'all didn't communicate some type of way through each other. So, this bitch watches you with some obsessive of you. Get a mirror. This bitch watches you some type of way because she's irritating as hell. What was the judgment in reverse about for this Ten of Pentacles? For this naked ass bitch. Somebody probably stood up there and said that you only wanted them for money. 
but you had your own fucking money and that's what they was really mad about that you didn't want them for nothing you didn't need them for nothing you didn't ask them for nothing that's what they really was mad about so anybody judging in reverse spirit and manifested for this ten of pentacles i'm gonna tell y'all to treat y'all selves Eight of Wands blocked. The sun is in reverse. Leo energy is an unhappy ass mud out here. Queen of Wands told you it's an unhappy individual out here. Hold on. Okay, sorry. Somebody burnt out with trying to harness your energy and send it to, to, to fuck with you. Because this could have been good. This could have been you just underestimating yourself. Don't feel like you're good enough or you worthy, worthy enough for a Ten of Pentacles. But by any means necessary, if you've been on my team, we moving forward. We want all the dank, okay? All the bank, all the dank, all the stank. We want all of it. This motherfucker is trying to... They're trying to change something. Your course of action. They're trying to feed you enough to keep you under them or something. They're sabotaging. But yeah, they're trying to keep you stuck in a situation. Queen of Wands and the Six of Swords is in reverse. They're trying to keep you stuck while investing behind your dog on back. They know how powerful you are. This is someone who has seen you come from the bottom up. And they probably seen you do it multiple times. This is a snake-ass fucking friend that's speaking venom on you. So I recommend y'all just... Y'all need to lay low because y'all I know everybody is looking for a friend right now. That's what the comment section is about. Seek seek a seek a friend within the community that you're in. And then some of them ain't all the way to be good. Cause I done met some of y'all and I'm sorry. Y'all gone. They gone for a reason. Cause some of them is really just here to harness you. They don't want to hear the truth. You you're going to find out a lot of people do not like to hear the truth if you don't feed their illusion they don't want you in their life so be just be careful around this time because this bitch is cold and she's competition this is someone who could come off as a friend but competing with you she's very close to you she could be real clever Sneaky and manipulative. Why is this snake even here, Spirit and Ancestors? What do this snake want with Cancer Leo Cubs? And this is someone who has been a side chick multiple times. Who, who will okay a third party situation as long as they getting paid or as long as they win or something like this. So this person has been a third party multiple times. This is nothing new to them. But she loves the attention. This is somebody trying to make you to be the third party, but they don't understand that you you the longest. No win. Seven of wands and a six of wands. That is why is this snake here for Cancer Leo? The Prince of Wands. Prince, Prince, Knight of Wands. Tell me about this Prince of Wands. She could be coming in with some type of communication towards you. Flighty as hell. God damn. Man. This is a mad ugly bitch. Yeah, three of cups and two of cups. Both in reverse. This a third party ass motherfucking hoe. She didn't. This You want to know what happened? I figured out. This is a bitch that competed with you. And she thought she won. She thought she won because you want to know this is a situation when a car break, the dude car break down or the female car break down. You like, well, you how much you got on it? And they think you about to pay for the whole thing only to find out you ain't paying for shit. But I'm going to help you find somewhere the payment arrangements and stuff like that. Right. You was more of a partner. OK, this person was more of a. I got you back. I got you. I got you. I got you. She was more of a mother. That's what she was. So now this person has no stability in their life. They don't know how to balance life because they keep going to people that's taking care of them, feeding them, feeding them fish instead of teaching them how to fish. So she will want up everything you do. This is somebody who constantly go back and forth with you. If it's a friend, she constantly is the opposite of everything you. She she the one believe Tory Lanez didn't do it. You know what I'm saying? Why you sit up there and say, yeah, the bitch did it. Some shit like that. 
she got all her uh, male identified reasons why Tori should be free. And you got all your feminine reasons why he should stay where the hell he at. I'm a, a distant example. Don't come for me. Me personally, he can stay where the fuck he at, okay? They're very malicious. They're very... I don't, I don't, I don't like this energy anymore. What? Well, tell me about this damn snake ass bitch. Why is this snake ass bitch got a problem with him? So we don't touch those feelings. What is the whole problem? Like, why, why she can't go away? Birthday could be on the twenty third. Dead peacocks. She got hand. She got hit in her asshole. Her ego got checked. This bitch had to sit her pride to the side. That's probably why she's coming in to communicate something to you. This is somebody who's going to say, you was right. He ain't shit. He doing this. He fucking this person. He fucking that person. She over here with him. She got money from this person. She only coming here to say this, to deter you from dealing with him when he come running back to you. Because she already know where he going. She ain't had no business dealing with him because she already knew he wasn't for her. And, and what's up? Turn back to the of wine. That's my damn cat. Her ego has been dead. Now, see, you didn't have to do nothing and her ego got deaded. Spirit deaded her ego. She took the humble pie and that's what she had to have. She thought she was going to have this longevity, stability. This is somebody who is very much so misfortunate and unfortunate. Tell me about this Prince of Wands, so Spirit and Ancestors, so we can get the hell on. This could be another fire or water sign. Tell me about this uh, Prince of Wands, Spirit and Ancestors. I'm going to do a red cup. See, I told you, this is a bitch that's always in, on some turn up shit. This is an old turn up bitch. Always trying to have a dream. She had an effect, shit didn't work. She had in the fact shit didn't work out with, with whatever the fuck she had going on. It didn't work out. She had in the fact that she was fucking with somebody and go wherever. Or this could be somebody who, who tried to one-up you in situationships. Y'all both dating, meeting do, new dudes. And every five minutes she talking about what a dude they did for her. Some shit she could have did her goddamn self. But she just lived to say some dude did it. Oh, he got my hair, my nails, and my toes on. He sent me $700 to get some bundles. Bitch, get off my phone. 